What is going on everybody? My name is Repel from youtube.com slash user slash Repel Games and we have another fan favorites battle today against Big Z. And the rules are we are going to be using UU Team. Which is fine. I totally love UU. But, you know, lately I've been really itching to just fight NU. So if you guys are watching this and you guys are interested in fighting NU, please let me know in the comments section and we can probably work something out. Alright, we got that going on. So UU team, he's got the Sceptile, the Dewblade, the Melotic, Mammal Swine, Honchcrow, and Rotom Heat. I got the Chandelier, Rotom Mo, Dawn Fan, Cobalion, Melotic, and Umbreon. Two. Hmm. I could have sworn. <laughs> could have sworn Mammal Swine was OU, but. Hmm. I guess they. Oh wow, it's UU now. Well, well, congratulations. It is in fact UU. So, uh, what will we do? Well, uh, you know what? Let's see. Mammal Swine. Mammal Swine. Sash lead, right? Uh, let's see. Rotomo. Rotom Cut. Choice Scarf. Well, Leaf Storm will decimate him, but I'm pretty sure he's carrying the focus. Sash. My hazards is the Cobalion, but I don't really want to off lead off of the Cobalion now, so, um... Oh, fuck it. Let's just go into Melotic. Let's do it. I always choose my team last second. I'm just such a wishy-washy kind of guy. Let's see what he's gonna lead off with. My money is Mammal Swine. Sceptile. Alright, terrible lead on my part. Bull. Bull lead on my part. Mega Sceptile. Most likely special attacking. I could switch into my Umbreon. My Umbreon is. Pretty much my special wall here. Umbreon, or I can go to Rotom Cut. Or I can go to Chandelier. Choice Scarf. Uh, let's just go into uh, Umbreon. Really bad lead on my part, but that is okay. Hopefully, man, protect, huh? Now he can't go for a focus blast. He really can, but um, I'm just gonna throw up a wish. I'm just gonna throw up a wish. Switching out, maybe he doesn't want to get poisoned or something. Goes into Dewblade, probably does not want to be poisoned. Now, Dewblade does have Sacred Sword. But I also have, um, I also have Foul Play. So, if he wants to go for Swords Dance this turn, it will sting. <laughs> it actually will sting. A little. Let's see. Plus two Shadow Sneak from Dewblade. And um, I do have Chandelier. Let's see. I could switch into Chandelier, but then the Shadow Sneak would completely destroy the living shit out of me. So, um, well, I can just go into Umbreon and stay with Umbreon, honestly. He'll probably stay here, maybe go for Sega Sword or either. Um, or either Swords Dance. I'm gonna go for Foul Play. I know I outspeed him. Do an alright amount. So he does go for Swords Dance. 
which honestly is kind of fine. That's the thing, I'm not sure if I can live in the next one. Dublade is just terrifying. Like, so scary, man. I'm just gonna have to go to... I'm just gonna have to go into... Can I go into Donphan? Donphan is also a defensive wall, not just my Melotic. And, um... Yeah, I'm just gonna go into Melotics. I knew he would go for a sword stance. I mean, that's just how you play Dewblade, which is fine. I would have done probably the same thing too. Sega Sword. This is great. Not even half. Oh, that is fantastic. Man, I love Malate. Oh, that is such a great wall. Bro. Bro. I have to go for a Skull now. Try to get a burn. He's switching out. Let's see who he's going to bring out. Probably Subtile. His own Melotic. Can I get a burn? No burn today. Now he's probably defensive, so he might go for Toxic or Scald. If he does go for the Toxic, I do have Umbreon. And that's exactly what I'm doing. I'm just going to go for Umbreon. Hopefully he goes for Toxic and I can synchronize him. That would be sweet. I can't believe Mammal Swine is you now. That is crazy. Sweet. Sweet. Alright. Predicted that really nicely. It's even better. I want the Melotic Badly Poison rather to be burned. It'd be great if he has Protect too, so then I can just have a free turn of going Heal Bell. I'm so glad I brought my Heal Beller, honestly. Oh, man, I look so dark. And I did get darker from the summer, summer heat and sunshine. Uh, what you gonna do, bro? Skull, really? Interesting. It's very interesting that he would actually stay in. Simply because it's a Melotic. <laughs> like, unless this Melotic has... Refresh. I'm going to outlast him. Oh, he needs to switch up. I'm gonna go for a wish. Maybe I can pass it to somebody. Yep, he's switching out. Dewblade again. Honestly, that's fine. You can just do whatever the hell you want. Bring out my Melotic. My Melotic is slightly weak, so I could just wish past it. My opponent could do a double switch here and go into like Sceptile or Rotom Heat to scare out my Melotic. But that's okay. If I ate a plus two Sacred Sword, I would eat up Yeah. A regular Sacred Sword. Like that's just how it goes, man. Let's go for a Scald. Maybe a Melotic can come back out. I don't know. Switch again. Rotem, wow. You are ballsy. Wow, you are so brave. Let's assume this uh, Rotem Heat is choice specs. Pit up against my Melotic. Thunderbolt should not kill. It really should not kill. Now he might go for a trick. Be pretty scary if he does go for a trick. Might go for a Will-O-Wisp. 
I'm just gonna go for Dawn Fan. I'm just gonna go for Dawn Fan. If he goes for a trick, that's that's fine, man. Oh, not bad. Double switch. Not bad at all. Double switch is nice, but in this case, my opponent is poison, so he does waste a turn getting poison residual damage. I really want to go to Cobalion now because I want to set up some goddamn stealth rocks. But is that wise? Can Cobalion take a Scald? He might go for, like, Toxic. But you know what? Fuck it. Let's just go to Cobalion. I want my stealth box now, bro. More than ever. That's fine. Ooh, that did a lot. Careful. I know, be careful, man. Could he be like modest nature? I don't know. I don't even care anymore. I'm just gonna go for stealth pass. He has no magic bouncers. I don't think he has a defogger unless the Mercro knows defog. But I'm gonna go for my stealth box. Interesting. Mammoth swines. It's very interesting because I have close combat. And I'm pretty sure I outspeed a mammoth swine, so um now he might go for his own. He might go for his own Stealth Rocks. And he might have Focus Sash. He might just end my life with Earthquake, but you know, I do have a Rotem Mo or Cut, which is immune, so my best bet is probably just stay in. Close combat. So he doesn't have Sash. I don't know what he was gonna do. My guess is that he probably was going to go for Stealth Rocks, and my guess is that he's probably going to, you know, scare me away because I am weak to Earthquake, but I do have speed him after all. This is great. I landed my Stealth Rocks, and I finished off Mammoth Swine, his potential hazards. Murkrow, probably Heat Wave. No, not Murkrow, sorry, Honchkrow. Um, or superpower. Very likely that it is superpower. Um, are you guys hearing my WhatsApp? <laughs> because I have a WhatsApp web browser that you guys might be able to hear. Superpower is my guess. Um, you know, superpower is definitely my guess. Just go into. Melotic. How much will it do to Melotic? Oh, I think it should be fine. Unless he goes for a Brave Bird, then that would sting, man. That would really sting. <sighs> I can go into Dawn Fan. Let's see. I'm just gonna go to Melotic. If he goes for a Brave Bird, he can potentially shoot two hit KO me right here. Superpower. Okay, good. Do you want to switch out, bro? I finished off his. Whoops. Ah, uh, messages on my phone. Uh, yeah, I'm using my phone to record this. Um. God damn it. Shush. I finished off his... Did I finish off his Rotom? Well, I finished off the Mammal Swine. Yeah, I just finished off the Mammal Swine, so... Let's go for another Scald. It's always good to just do some res residual damage. Not a whole lot, but some. 
Switching out. Sceptile, maybe. Melotic back. That's good. It's not a lot, but I do get some stealth rocks and a little bit of skull damage, so... Yeah, I cannot complain. I really cannot complain. And I do have a nice wall for this Melotic. My Umbreon. Do, 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 do. Let's see, what is he gonna do now? I don't really know what he's gonna do. Maybe that's just a skull, but. Yeah, I'm just gonna go to Umbreon. It's so safe to go to Umbreon. Like, so safe. if you want to go for toxic I mean maybe he wants to use up all my toxic but if in order to do that like he's gonna have to stay in with his melotic a lot <laughs> that's the thing about walls like melotic they're really useful but once they're poisoned they're not as useful anymore because they can't afford to stay in so yeah that's fine still got lots of heal bell actually how many heal bells do I have left? I have four more heal bells. So maybe he wants to go for toxic four more times. Withdrawn again. Two blade. Do blade. I wonder if I should switch out again. Maybe I can just stay and just go for another foul play on my on my Umbreon. It's good damage. Yeah, it's really good damage. Let's go for foul play. Maybe he'll go for a sword stance. Oh, he'll do a double switch. That's good. I'm glad I didn't switch out. It's just a little too obvious that I'm switching out so much. Mega Sceptile. Like I said, Mega Sceptile can learn Focus Blast, but truth be told, it's just not enough to finish me off. So I'm just going to go for Foul Play right here. He could switch out again. My opponent is switching out a little bit too much, I think. Um, it's not It's not. It's not really doing him any favors because the Stealth Rocks, stealth rocks is <laughs> it's hurting him quite a lot. I already selected my command, so we're just waiting for my opponent now. I just went for foul play. I could have went for a wish, you know, it's nice to get some recovery too next turn. <sighs> Protect. Eh, I guess I could have went for a foul play right there. Something tells me he doesn't really want to waste his Sceptile. The only Pokemon that can really take the foul play now is probably the Murkrow. But my rocks are up. It'd be great if he switches into a Murkrow. Is it the Murkrow? Switching out. Huh, it's very interesting. We'll I'll probably go for a recover this turn. I'm staying in. There's really no point for me to switch out. Hey, it's nice. You get to recover. I'm just afraid you can't really do too many things to me, so... Let's go for a wish now.
It's hmm. waiting for my opponent. Switching out, maybe Makro. Rotem. Ooh, I could have went for foul play and finish his miserable life right there. He might have trick. He actually might have trick. Um <laughs> I don't want my Rotom I don't want my Umbreon to have. Yeah. I'm gonna go to Chandelure. Is it wise to go to Chandelier? Like, he just might go for a T-Ball. Well, I don't know if he'll go T-Ball on my Umbreon, like... Umbreon is so damn powerful. Uh, let's go to Chandelier, maybe expecting the fire attack. And if he does go for a trick, that's like the same fucking thing, because we both are probably carrying the same thing. If he goes for Volt Switch, that, that is really good. He might actually win. Trick. Okay, great. <laughs> Let's see what we both get. <laughs> yeah, we both get Choice Scarf. Uh, it's like the same shit, honestly. <laughs> oh man, what what is he gonna do now? He's gonna go for Volt Switch. Uh, <laughs> I can just bring in like. He can go for Volt Switch, but what is he gonna send out? Like, nothing in his team really wants to take anything. Let's say, let's say he has Modest Nature as well, and he has Choice Scarf. <laughs> I could bring out my Dawn Van expecting the Volt Switch. Volt Switch is very obvious, but you know, Chandelier still takes it pretty well, so I'm just gonna go for a Fire Blast. I'm just gonna go for Fire Blast. Yeah, he's gonna go for full switch. Um, I think he's dead. He just switched out, so I think he's dead. He might as well just stay in and just go for a Thunderbolt, do as much as he can, because that Rotom is dead now, thanks to Stealth Rocks. Now, who wants to take a Fire Blast? Oh, of course, Melotic. Ah, should've went for a Shadow Ball then, or an Energy Ball. Look at that, I got a critical. Maybe I can kill from this range. I'm just gonna risk it, let's just go for a fire blast. Hope that I can kill it. Um, good chance I might not, who knows. Good chance I might miss too, and then he'll just kill me with a scald. Hey, let's just do it. I don't miss. Can I kill? And I kill. Chandelier finishing off Melotic. Not bad. Sucker Punch. Or he could go for a Pursuit expecting that I would switch out. Oh man, if he goes for Pursuit, I think I'm dead too. Either way, I'm dead. I mean, I have to predict this really nicely, but I'm thinking it's probably the Sucker Punch. Yeah, I'm more leaning towards the Sucker Punch, so... Ooh, I have so many things I can go into. Cobalion's one too. Shit. Let's go into um, Melotic. Please don't go for Pursuit. Alright, no Pursuit. He definitely went for Sucker Punch then. Ooh, he went for a Roost! God damn it! Oh, you little... You... You little... You sneaky little thing. Good job, good job. Well played. Just gonna go for Scald. 
brave bird. Okay, this is gonna sting. Oh, I got a crit. Ow. Damn it, you got a crit. No, I still want my... I still want my Velotic. I think I am gonna have to go into my Dawn fan now. Eat up one Brave Bird and then just finish him off with an Ice Shard. I think that's what I have to do. Uh, yeah. I think my Melotic is a little too important, so... I much prefer just... Now you go go for Sucker Punch. Oh, actually, I'll go for Brave Bird, huh? Oh, he hasn't died yet. Ice Shard? Can Ice Shard outspeed Sucker Punch? It should. He has to stay in and let his Hunch Crow die. Rocks are up. Yeah. Thankfully. Thankfully, I still have Dawn Fan. Sceptile? Hmm, can my... Let's see. My Ice Shard should kill the Sceptile. Oh, that's Mega Sceptile. Never mind. Let's see. Regular Sceptile. It should. Um, it should, yeah. Okay, he mega evolves too, so he is dragon and grass now. Four times week to grass, I mean, four times week to ice. Not bad. Not bad at all. Rotems. And yeah, do have stealth box after all. Um, he has Dew Blade left, I think. Dew Blade is his last Pokemon, but I outspeed Dew Blade, and um, Earthquake should kill. It might not kill, but it should kill. He, on the other hand, I don't think he can kill me. Okay, yeah, yeah. And then what? He'll go for Ice Shard next... He'll go for Shadow Sneak next turn, but... Shadow Sneak won't kill unless he gets a critical. We'll see, though. Maybe he'll get a critical. No, no crit. Pretty good. I have to say, um, I really like Big Z's team. I really love my team, too. Uh, I think everyone had... A good amount of screen time so this was a pretty fun match not gonna lie thank you Big Z uh, really awesome team honestly love how we both have two melodic so guys if you guys do enjoy my Dawn fan <laughs> and my Umbreon please let me know in the comment section or you can just leave a like really nice to just leave a like and uh, make sure to comment and subscribe. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you guys next time.